history and especially Oregon Trail history is important because of how inspiring it can be. Uh, this was an incredibly difficult journey that people chose to make. They volunteered to leave everything behind and come here um, in the hopes of finding something better. Well, we have the Oregon Trail ruts right here and all the stories that go with that. We think about 10% of the ruts that were originally made across the country are still in existence. So part of coming here is to see the resource and part of it is to interact with the interpreters and to get more information in that way. Most of those immigrants actually walked beside their wagons rather than riding in them like Hollywood would make you think. People would start in Independence, Missouri um, in the springtime because it takes six whole months to get here and some of the last things you have to go through are some fairly large mountains. Um, so you wanted to get here before winter. Look how fat mine is, Dad. There's all sorts of things visitors can see here. We've got um, exhibits about the start of the journey, uh, help, things to help people try to plan what they would pack as well, which was oftentimes the hardest part. Um, there's candle dipping, a 25 minute movie, some pioneer dress up if you want to try on these petticoats and see how far you could walk in them. So the Bigger Heritage Museum is definitely different and unique um, just in that I feel the Interpretive Center talks about the experience of people coming to Baker City and going on the Oregon Trail. We talk a lot about what happens after they got here. Our history focuses a lot on gold mining and the other industries that happen here, so logging, um, ranching, things along those lines, and, and we do a really good job of telling the story of those experiences for our founders, essentially. <laughs> it is very personal. Any, anyone who lives here probably has some sort of Oregon Trail story, uh, whether or not it's a modern one or a, a 19th century one. They love this immigration story. They love the idea of the whole trip and travel and change in our life. And so many of us um, experience that kind of change, move from our families, go places and do things. And I think that if these folks hadn't set that standard for us, America would be a very different place without that spirit of adventure.